where's the beef? <laughs> when I hear somebody talk about a beef, that's how old I am. I, I just think about the, the hamburger commercial. But now a beef is uh, oftentimes when two athletes are arguing about something and a cowboy and an eagle are arguing about something and it's basketball. Mike Fisher uh, reporting from Frisco, home of the Dallas Cowboys and reporting on the NFC East where we pay attention to the Eagles and the Cowboys and uh, the NBA as well via DallasBasketball.com. So the beef, of course, uh, if you're a Philadelphia sports fan right now, has a great deal to do with not only the fact that the Eagles are struggling, but that Sixers kind of star, Ben Simmons, things aren't going well for him and for the team. And somehow Dallas Cowboys wide receiver Noah Brown has inserted himself into the controversy revolving around Simmons and uh, his inability to get along with the Sixers. Simmons' issues, of course, have caused separation between him and the Sixers and another prominent Philly athlete, the Eagles lineman Jason uh, Kels Kelsey, took to social media to chide Simmons, saying kind of in defense of the fans in his city, you write your own narrative here. What's going on? I don't want to crush anybody. But what's going on with the Sixers and Ben Simmons, that's a lack of accountability, a lack of owning up to your mistakes, a lack of correcting things. If all that got corrected, you fix the free throws, you get better as a player, none of this is happening. Everybody can bitch and complain about how tough this city is to play in. Just play better, man, and this city will love you. The city of brotherly love, in fact, does not have the reputation, not really, that Jason claims it has. Regardless, Brown, who is a native of Flanders, New Jersey, and that's important because Flanders, New Jersey is kind of a suburb of Philadelphia. So Noah Brown, the Cowboys backup, backup wide receiver, may know what he's talking about when he decides to jump in to the fray and be now an instrumental part of the beef. Flanders, New Jersey is located just an hour outside of Philadelphia and Noah Brown, part of the five and one Cowboys, took to social media himself to criticize athletes, meaning the Eagles player, for their negativity toward Simmons, suggesting that those views are simply attempts to curry favor with local fans. Except Noah didn't say curry favor. What he said was this, earmuffs, all these Philly athletes trying to shit on Simmons for extra pat on the back from Philly fans. All these guys are dumping on Simmons trying to get an extra pat on the back from Philly fans. Cornball activity, Brown wrote on social media. And by the way, cornball is one of the ultimate insults. If you really want to insult somebody in a beef, you say that they're cornball. Brown, of course, is referencing the Eagles player's uh, view on Ben Simmons. And now it's a beef, I guess, with Simmons, who... Uh, those close to that situation suggest might be dealing with mental health issues in the middle and Cowboys versus Eagles on either side. It has been pointed out by the national media that the beef could really come to a head when Dallas, right now a NFC East leading juggernaut, which has already embarrassed the Eagles once this season, that this is going to come to a head when they play again, Cowboys at Philadelphia, they don't even play this calendar year. They play January 9th, 2022. The problem with the national media view of the coming beef between the Eagles offensive lineman and the Cowboys offensive wide receiver is they both play offense. The chances of Noah Brown conflicting with the Eagles offensive line is tiny. Probably unlikely to encounter one another, but the city, notoriously hard on visiting athletes. And yes, sorry, Jason, hometown athletes too. The city now might have a beef with one of its own in Noah Brown. Now the Eagles, Jason argues, I really don't think this is a hard place to play, to be honest with you. That's how he's trying to coach Ben Simmons out of what might be a mental health issue. And as with most beefs, it might be wise for everybody to just 
turn down the heat on the beef fish out.